Hi guys, so on Hyperland, yes it is, and use the ISOs, right? Other things be Hyperland. Now, I just made a video about the original, right, the source of Hyperland, and there were some errors, and I've made a workflow video how to recover from errors. But I wanted to do something. I saw something that might be interesting to have and to keep in our config as well. So all the tiling window managers that we have, we have the same blue color, the color from the logo from Arclinux. But in the video that I made with the source code, there is a gradient, right? So what is that? So hyperlint, that's the default, that's the source. And if we go here, we have exact, exactly the same thing, but you know me, I always need to have a <laughs> So this one and that one, source, our vision, his look, right? Different guys, different look, different choices. Now, the thing, the color we're gonna look for, the thing that I want to check out, if maybe, right, maybe we should go for something else as a look, as color, has to be somewhere in the hyperlink, I would think, right? Decoration, it's some kind of, feeling that it was, um, how do you say, gradient-like. It has to do with the border. So how control find, how do you find the border? Here is a border size, active and inactive. And here you have two choices. Right? So what if control C we go for that particular code and was that an issue i believe that was an issue let's see not at this point in time so we have this blue up here and take a good look at the video because this is more to the purplish kind of coloring it's actually nicer <laughs> i like this better that means you're gonna get an update you're gonna get this code coming in and it's 45 degrees right 90 degrees this is 90 that's 45 so blue up here and purplish down here and if you're wondering how do i know that this, this is purplish um then you do something like this don't take the last two because of the transparency so red green blue two 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 six take six with you and then you go to Firefox or something and then you just type in hashtag color code and then you know okay so that's how it's defined that's the color code and it is up here it's blue and down here it's more purple and it's super okay with this kind of icons right so voila I'm going to implement this into the code. You'll see it and it will come and appear in the ETC scale. And if you already have an hyperlink uh, system, then you need to compare what did I change, right? Do you see what I've changed in this video? And that's exactly what I'll do right now. Cheers.